Hello, my name is Abe. Welcome back to Dicey Dungeons Jester Parallel Universe. Let's go for it. At least we're not playing the witch. That's how I'm gonna think about it. Are you fighting fit or battle wary? We're revisiting Dicey Dungeons. Yes, I know we won before, but we're back for more. As the Jester. Is this the Boop and Bop build? No, this is the Kapow and Blammo build. I had to remember. Uh, but we should definitely go for the Blammos. Blammo. Blammo. Blammo! And... Gumball Machine. Definitely worth adding. Anything that does something and gives you a dice back is Definitely something we're gonna have in basically every single build, I think. So Blammo, Blammo, discard, discard, discard. Perfect. I didn't even care about the heal because we're at full health. I just wanted to make sure that we could get the, uh, the high roll out of it and it worked. Oh right, alternate rules. I forgot. I can't. I can't. <laughs> Alright, well, I mean, hopefully we can get to the other Blammo. Nope. Alright, well, I guess we just heal. Get Limit Break next turn. I forgot that the... Uh, oh, never mind. We're not going to get Limit Break. I forgot that the um, rule of this one was different. The burn doesn't do damage, it just makes your equipment unusable. There's our snap. Mm, got him. All right, full health. Okay, this is interesting. We've played with both of these pre in, uh, in previous runs. We have the dog build and the curse build. Curse build is really good because it locks down the enemy if the curse applies, and it does a lot of damage. But maintaining fury with woof, 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 rough, rough, rough is really good as well. We're gonna go dog build specifically because the last run was curse. We're gonna do something different, but I do like the curse build. I actually think it's pretty good. This actually sucks. Um, dude, honestly, I think you just do that, do that, do this. The fact that we can't play anything on that turn sucks, but we rolled extremely poorly. I don't mind the burns. I don't mind the burns. And we rolled much better this time around. So, we need to engage Fury. Then, you can snap. And we can blind him. Okay, good. <laughs> now, burn, oh sorry, not burn, fury is different. It prevents your equipment from being used on a future turn, but it's still good damage on the turn in which you use it. Action, keep a blank for next turn. Uh, you know, because this is upgraded, Oh, it's a finale card. We have oh, we have to take it. That's a good finale card. I was just trying to think, you know, do we take it? Do we not take it? But it's not a card. It's a finale. So if you hit finale, you might as well hold a card for your next, you know, iteration. Makes sense to me. Also, woof 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 has to be upgraded first. Uh, I just remembered because it is not that good unless it's upgraded. And at least you're not doing that much damage to us. And luckily, I can... rough it up. Now, I don't get dice back. I can't really do anything else on the turn, but... You know, we can kapow twice. At least. Yeah, something. And we will... I think heal up to full after this, which is nice. Don't have fury anymore. Um, 
Jeez, this turn. Rolling low with the rough, rough, rough sucks, though. A at least with the curses, you're able to put a dice into it and get it out of the way, you know? With this rough, 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 if I have a one and a two, I have to spend two dice to get one action out of it. That doesn't seem that good. So I'm starting to think that actually the, um, the curse build is better than this build. This build might be a little bit more interesting with the whole being able to fury and then get free value out of the, your other cards, but start to think that the other build is better. Alright. It's unavailable, but it still showed up in the list. Oh, that is... So burning dice can screw your run. Basically, is what I'm getting from this. That is that is horrible. Oh, but you can discard matching unavailable cards. <laughs> I understand. I hate it, but I, but I understand. Yeah, I kind of want to go back and take the curse instead of what we have right now, but well, you know, can't change it. We're just gonna have to be stuck with it and hope that we can upgrade these cards, because we need to. Split dice evenly is okay. But, uh, you know, again, what do I always say about the Jester? You want quantity over quality. You want as many dice as you can get, and things like Subdivide get you there, because it gives you multiple dice. But with something like Woof 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 or Rough Rough Rough, you have to have quality and quantity. You need to have high enough rolls that you can play eight or four if it's upgraded. You have to have enough die value that you can get three out of one dice. So maybe this is not very good for the Jester because it kind of goes against the whole archetype that the Jester has from the very beginning, which is quantity. You, you need quantity and we can't get quantity. Dice value minus one on one instead return two ones. Ones. Again, quantity and quality means you can't take a lollipop because you lose value and you need value. So we can't take that. We just gotta move on. Now hopefully we can snap here. This is good enough. So like, even now, do you subdivide? I suppose you should. So that maybe you can hit Blamo, But you're gonna hit the Kapow anyways. Because Woof 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 takes eight before you... Yeah, eight right now, which is two dice. A two in Sour Candy means Kapow is gonna break. So yeah, to snap. Then you might as well Spend in Kapow. Oh, that was a kill. Lovely. <laughs> it was a super enemy, so I'm glad we killed him in one turn, but... Had to happen. Then we upgrade. We make sure that this gets upgraded immediately, because it saves us a little bit on quality. Reroll a dice maintains fury. If you can make this, like, activate, it's really good. So I'm going to buy it because it's a Fury card, and we're going to destroy the Kapows. I know that we should probably save them for uh, low rolls if we have nothing else to do with them, but I I also just kind of just want to dump them. I'm thinking to myself that maybe we can double down on Fury. The problem is you need to get Woof Woof Woof, and if you don't get Woof Woof Woof, you're not doing doing anything, but I still think it's worth trying for. Dude, the music is awesome. Subdivide the six. Dump the Blamos. We're going to... Okay. Dump. Kapow dump Sour Candies. We're gonna be able to activate our Fury. So, activate Fury. And then honestly, probably end turn. Next turn we can reroll a dice, maintain Fury, 
discard the Kapows. Dude, the music's a little loud. Um, and then maybe be able to get to woof woof woofs and blam blam blams and all the other good stuff that we got. So re-roll the two, twice. Discard the Kapows. Give me more fury. Discard the Sour Candies. Now we have Double Fury, which we want to use with Rough Rough Rough, not something like Subdivide. But we literally have to spend it here. So now I'm like, God damn it. <laughs> like, oh, come on. So now we have, we have quantity and zero quality whatsoever. We, we can't activate Ruffs, we can't activate Blamos. I guess literally I could activate a Ruff to do five damage, but we basically um, use a Finale card, Achievement Unlocked. We basically done nothing on that turn and we opened it with our, our strongest ability, Fury. It powers the entire deck and we got no value from it because we had to waste Fury on just dumping dice into a random card. Yeah, Fury, I, I don't like it as a Jester. I've decided, not for me. Also, goodbye, Poison. <laughs> Hopefully it goes away forever. Uh, give me a new dice. That's unavailable, that's fine. Dump those. Uh, what? I'm calling a little bit of BS on that one. I, I know exactly what the game thinks happened. I played a four into Woof 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 on the previous turn, but it didn't actually get doubled from Fury, so I thought it would still maintain itself on the next turn, but it didn't. Also, we did take poison damage by discarding poison. <laughs> you know, it did not do what I thought it would do. So that's, that's, I mean, that's dumb, kind of. I guess we'll do six damage and end turn and keep taking more poison because, uh, cause yeah. Like, if you can thin out the deck where you only have Fury cards, yeah, I could see it being really good. But right now, like, if you can get double Ruff Ruff Ruff, sorry, Woof Woof Woof. <laughs> If you can get double woof woof woof, I could also see that being pretty good, but right now, it just doesn't seem that worthwhile. I can't I can't do anything. It's too finicky, your 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 deck is far too thick. We're also dead. <laughs> Unless we kill him on this turn, we are actually completely utterly dead, so um I'm gonna hit you. I'm gonna yip. I'm going to gumball. I'm gonna blam. And kill you. Wow, that was insane. Table slam, reroll all unused dice. No, I'm not gonna take it. I, I don't think we need to worry about rerolling. You do get the dice back, but. Okay, rough, 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 rough would be a good combo. Can we get it? Well, let's do it anyways. Kapow. Another Blamo's coming up, so dump Kapow. Hit Sour Candy. Hit Blamo. Hold on to a three. Woof 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 next turn. We're gonna take some damage. Hopefully that charges up the limit break, I think, because we're about to level up. And we do have Fury, but I guess it doesn't, like if you can snap, you might as well. If you can snap, it, um, we can do a lot of damage, but that's not because of Fury, that's just because of Snap. Copy a random item from your deck. Uh, no. Add an extra card to your hand this turn. Yes. That is good. So 
also this. Rough, woof, rough. So, woof. Okay, then you yip. Then you rough. Then you rough. Then we still have fury. So, because we can get more dice, let's subdivide for the kapows. Kapow. 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 That's not a kapow. We do have a lot of blamos, but let's dump them. <laughs> See if we can maybe action. Dude, honestly, that's a pretty good turn. Now, will all of the things that we furied be unavailable? Well, I can't discard these. They're match. Oh, actually, they're not matching. I should be able to kill. It's not available. I guess if you're gonna take damage, you might as well snap, right? Which yip? Which yip doesn't do it? Yeah, okay, I, I see now. By playing the cards with Fury, they're also unavailable on your next turn. Dude, uh, Parallel Universe Fury dog build doesn't... It, the more I'm playing it, the more I'm like, wow, this sucks. <laughs> like, really? That that's That's awful. You can only do your your abilities once every other turn. So even if you get like the perfect draw, even if you build your deck perfectly, you're still getting half value from it with the Fury build. It doesn't seem that good. Um, let's destroy a, another. Let's destroy a. Destroy a. Let's destroy a Kapow. I really don't know if that's the best option, but let's do it anyways. Removing removing your vision of what comes up next seems pretty bad. You act, you do get a lot of value from. Uh, I'm just gonna double woof immediately. Uh, you do get a lot of value from seeing what's coming up, but I think that you get more value from having a fourth card that you can discard. So we're gonna get another woof. The Furies, you know, still might be the best thing for us. Let's give it a shot. We're gonna fight Super, Super Stereo Head. We're gonna try to fight the uh, Apple last because his attack is garbage. Super Stereo Head also sucks. So we got two roughs coming up. This is actually very, very good of a turn. We can't snap, but that's okay. What we're gonna do is double up, get more dice, Do double damage. We got nothing else to do with the ones, so I'm just gonna dump it into Kapow. Nah, give me Sour Candy. That was actually pretty good. Dump the Kapows. I could woof, woof, woof. Instead, I'm gonna play Blamo to dump it. So it doesn't show up next turn. We're gonna take six damage, have two weaken. Hopefully we can still Fury. It's probably gonna take a lot of rolls though. More than eight. Or equal to eight. No, right, Fury takes more damage, I forget. I forget, I forget. Double up on Ruff. Then, we could snap Blamo, but we have to play one card first. If we're gonna play one card first, let's play Sour Candy for healing. Then let's snap the Blamo. Cause we know we're gonna take damage anyways, let's get that damage out there for free.
Okay, subdivide. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Okay, Woof and Blamo are coming up. Woof. Blamo. You know what? Just go for the kill. I, I, I could discard and try to look for Sour Candy, but I'm just gonna go for him. Okay. Snowman. Do I want to fight a snowman? Game Fury at the start of your turn. Rough, rough. Dude, honestly, let's go for it. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> the word you don't know what to play? Well, oh. I find myself in that situation all the damn time. But you know what? I. This is weird. I, uh. I like Dicey Dungeons. Play some Dicey Dungeons. What the heck are we supposed to do here? Multi card? We already had cards? I don't know. We have Fury. We don't need to arf, arf, arf. So I'm not gonna arf, arf, arf. I'm just gonna end my turn. You know, if I can double up on Subdivide, that's still decent. We're also gonna take 11 damage, and we're gonna have all ones. Uh, I guess Subdivide is not that good against Snowman. <laughs> all right, let's snap. Actually, it's not all ones, which is actually, you know, not the end of the world. Snap. Sour Candy's coming up. Might as well Arf gain multiple fury next turn. Can blammo. Then you can sour candy heal. And then do nothing. We can reroll a dice. And then activate fury on this turn. Sure, you know. Now we'll have just a million fury next turn if we live, we will live. We'll have, hopefully, something that we can play. Please? We got all ones! What? I, I can do 15 damage. No, it, what? Fi isn't Fury supposed- oh, Maintain Fury probably only makes the Fury proc once instead of, like, multiple times. Alright, well, we are- we're living? Excuse me? And we have dice to play? What? What universe is this? I don't understand. Uh, please dump the Blamos and hit him for rough. I still don't know how we're going to live through this, but I think it goes through subdivide right now. That's kind of what I was hoping for. Then Kapow. Witch. Kapow. Get a new dice. It's a one. <laughs> Reroll a dice. It's a one. Heal. Calm the F on. We're living again, which is stupid. And we will live, which is stupid. <laughs> um, but that was a horrible turn. The fury on Parallel Universe, you just can't use your cards on the next turn. It's, it's garbage. What the hell are we going to upgrade? Takes any dice. Does more damage. Split any dice. Takes any dice to reroll a dice to maintain fury. Keep double blanks for the ne next 
turn, but it requires two dice? That doesn't seem that good. Uh, heal more. Dude, I wish you could upgrade more in a run. You can only upgrade like four cards. It's kind of unfortunate. Gumball machine for healing might actually be what we want, but I think I'm just gonna go subdivide. No, but, god damn it. Upgrade subdivide. I'm going for subdivide because if I don't, then I'm never gonna be able to play it. So we got Blamo, Arp, and Yip. We're gonna snap. And we're gonna gain Fury next turn. Then, we're gonna snap. We're going to... I'm gonna do a Kapow. Woof. Because now we have... Oh, we, we snapped. Heck yeah! <laughs> There's a uh, 20 damage right there, okay. Yeah, I guess if you have Fury, you might as well use it. So maintain Fury, yes. Not great rolls. Rough, might as well. Next card you play is gonna be played three times. I think Gumball Machine is good here. We gain a lot of dice, but we can also woof, woof, woof immediately. Into a rough, rough, rough. Into a blammo. Oh my god, we've done it. <laughs> Is Fury good? I don't know. Add one to all dice less than six. Dude, that's so good. We want quality and quantity. Adding dice seems pretty good. So I'm gonna take it. I like destroying cards, but you know, can only do so many things. So copy equipment. Would we copy the witch and the robot or like a subdivide or woof woof woof? I have no idea, but let's open up all of the apples first and then we'll do that last. Okay, sour candy rough, no thank you. Kapow Gumball Machine, no thank you, but we have to spend something on something. Then, Robot, buff my dice. Reroll a dice, maintain Fury. Discard the Roughs. Subdivide a six. Discard the Roughs. Now, we, now, we're, now, we, now we're sorted, now we got this stuff going. Gain Fury next turn, double, woof woof woof. Double again, keep the blamos, Dude, I actually think that's a pretty good turn. You arf? You woof? Then we're gonna woof again. Although, it, it, I hate it, because we're not getting double value from the Fury, but it's also not gonna show up next turn because of Fury. It's very annoying. Um, we're gonna discard... Nothing. We're gonna end turn, and we're gonna wait till next turn, because it'll reshuffle. We're also gonna have a locked dice, which is bad, but it could be worse. All we need is like one good value. Oh, you know what? I, I forgot. Locked dice have to be used in order, which is not that bad. It also didn't shuffle. <laughs> but we got whoops coming up. This is perfect. What? We multi-carded like 10 times? That was your fury? Oh, I am pissed now. <laughs> that is so bad. God damn it. I hate I hate it so much. Yeah. Fury is so fucking bad. I hate it. I hate it so much. At least we can snap now, though. But there's nothing to snap. We rolled, we rolled a, a four. We rolled four. We, we... Oh, good. We furied the thing that gives us fury. <laughs> Fucking goddamn it! I... Okay. Well, we can snap again. Please. Please, please, 
please, please. Okay, split. We got a lot of dice. Then, you whoop, you snap, you hit. Now apparently, if I click robot, it's gonna snap it like three times. Do I really mind? Well, I mean, yes and no. I might prefer to heal instead of adding like six to all my dice rolls. So let's heal and get dice. We'll add to all rolls. We'll rough, snap. Apparently that card's unavailable, who, who would've known? <laughs> Might as well double up on Kapow, as far as I'm concerned. Oh yeah, the witch is unavailable too, don't forget about that. What happened? It doesn't matter, you're dead, I hate it. <laughs> Aim's really good at this game. You shush. Well, let's heal. Fight Doggo. Oh my god, these rolls are so bad. This is why I don't like Fury, because if you roll poorly, you just can't do anything. At least with Curse, you can apply Curse. But we lit we cannot do anything on this turn except for activate Fury for the next turn. That's the only thing we can do on that turn. And he rolled amazingly. Luckily, he can only do four damage, but still. <sighs> okay. So we're gonna Fury. We're gonna Fury sub... <sighs> you know what, honestly? Keep Fury. You, you know, don't subdivide. I think you just keep Fury, because it's so hard to activate right now. We're gonna take four damage plus two poison, but that's not too bad. And we maintain fury for this turn. Okay, watch this. Curse? I didn't actually realize we were cursed, but that's actually not that bad. <laughs> watch this, we're cursed. I would like to heal. I would like to heal. Okay. Woof. Rough. Rough. You might as well just not use the witch. It ruins your fury, but I mean, you're we're killing the enemy on the next turn anyways. And we're not taking that much damage. This has not been too bad, actually. We healed up, technically. Actually, did we heal up? We may have healed up. May have. Yo, there's a small chance we'll live. I <laughs> And I find that crazy. Hmm, do you arf, or do you woof, or do you rough, or do you subdivide? <laughs> um. Okay. I got an idea. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't want to discard these, but I hate that they both showed up immediately. All right, woof. Give me a... Give me another woof. Next turn we're gonna rough. Although, we're only gonna get 10 damage out of it, not 15. Even though the Fury should probably be applied twice. But we're gonna do it anyways. Oh yeah, and you lock too. Eh, perfect, wonderful. You're the best. Okay, so double up on whatever you can. Now we still have multiple fury. 
I'm okay with this because we're gonna get we're gonna get robot, which is gonna add one to all dice. So then, gain fury, add dice, and now I think you just do damage. We snapped? I don't remember snapping, but apparently we snapped. <laughs> so we're gonna snap as much as we can. You know, we can woof on this turn. Actually, we can double woof. Dude, let's double woof. One of them is unavailable! Well, in that case, Let's woof. <laughs> Let's woof. Hate this. Love it. Hate it. Love it. Okay. Now we've got double fury and a rough and a woof. So I think you're rough. 10 damage. We don't need woofs. We don't need to click on the witch. Are we okay healing three and getting three dice? I think we are. Because then, we know we have Sour Candy and Rough coming up. We are going to Blammo. Witch. Rough. Discard. Heal. Rough. How are we still in this? This is so weird. <laughs> Okay, now all we have to do is fight a cowboy who, if he rolls enough sixes, we die. Okay. Also, uh, like, apparently if you end turn with the witch active, you get it active on your next combat, which is definitely not intentional. It's weird that that's working that way, but I'm not gonna complain, because it's beneficial for me. At least it doesn't activate snap. <laughs> I'm going to discard. I was really hoping to get, you know, more value out of breaking the game with the, uh, with the, uh, multiple s slots that we could see. Yeah, well, ap apparently we just have, it's the witch! Is that it? it? Did we break it by duplicating Furying the Witch and then we have multiple turns of having four cards? Is that actually what happened? That may have been what happened. So that was Fury. We're gonna subdivide. We're gonna Gumball. And we need to kill him so we're gonna snap. We have a lot of dice but I'm gonna do it anyways. Might as well do that. Might as well heal. Might as well fury. Might as well fear. Might as well fury. Then heal. Then keep a six for next turn. And. I screwed it up. <laughs> and he's gonna do 18 damage. No, he's gonna do 12. I I thought we, I, I didn't realize it took an even. I thought it was a, a woof or yarp, a yip. Uh, doesn't fucking matter. I thought it was something it wasn't. Just get me to sour candy. Thank you. I made a mistake. Hopefully that doesn't Oh, he lived, because it was the end of the fight. Oh, it was the end of the floor. We've done it. Now what do we want? I think a secondary robot is amazing. To give us more value on dice, that's 
pretty freaking good, especially because we have two subdivides. Dude, I'm gonna go double robot. I, I need more, I need high values so we can activate our, our dog abilities. <laughs> Jester versus Madison. I guess we're never gonna fight the Jester again as a boss because he's us now. All right, Madison, uh, you scare me. You're also mean to freeze, oh no. Didn't have much to say about today, but beating you terribly in a fight is going to make a great entry. Good roll. Might as well, we want to get to Woof and Arf. That's not that bad. We can Fury the attack and then uh, maybe Fury something else before we reactivate Fury. Okay, we're gonna take a, a, a little bit of damage. It's not that bad. This is Parallel Universe though, because the burn is different. So if we burn something, it's not gonna be used next turn. We might as well burn something that's already gonna be burned. So goodbye, Rough. Hopefully it's not unavailable for two turns. You might as well yip with the four. And then you might as well... Kapow. No. You might as well sub... You might as well... Kapow. Then... You're gonna woof. You're gonna snap. You're gonna blam. Subdivide. You're gonna reactivate Woof. <laughs> You're gonna rough. And then we could add dice rolls, we could do double damage with Kapow, or we could heal and get more dice. I think we're gonna go... Get more dice. Then... Robot. Then, Witchet. Actually, we could save Witchet for the next combat. Let's Kapow. Sour Candy. Gain Fury next turn. If we're gaining Fury, we'll keep Rough. We'll Blammo. We'll Sour Candy. Witch, Robot, Rough. Seems like a pretty good turn next turn. Yo, we're gonna win. We're gonna kill Madison. And I love it. Because I had zero confidence in this deck <laughs> from the very beginning. <laughs> but it doesn't matter, because we're gonna freaking win. I am gonna d double up on multi-card though. Theoretically, for the next two turns, we have that ability now. Ability now. Uh, if that's how it works, which I think it might be. Wow. Um, you know? Sure. <laughs> that's a very strange, um, set of cards to have on that turn, but maybe it'll work. It was a gumball machine. We should double up on on this first, then snap. Guys, my snap's broken. Okay, you know what? Fine, <laughs> we're gonna do it like this. <laughs> Repeat next attack. Snap. It's unavailable! It doesn't matter because you're dead anyways, but I'm I'm distressed that it was unavailable. Yo, we've done it. Another triumph. The Jester. Parallel Universe 5 achievement unlock completed. Challenge complete, use a finale card. Who did we get? Keymaster? Oh lord. This guy he he weirds me out. I'm I don't want to talk to him anymore. Complete all six bonus rounds. We got Scathage. 
Okay. Karaoke go to Sorry Not Sorry. I love her. All She's my waifu just because of the fact that she has that as her favorite karaoke go to song. And Warlock for completing five parallel universes. He wanted the power to command the winds and rains and the empty spaces of the world. Also a toaster. You should get together with Scathage because she has that power with her storm ability. Yo, we've done it. Uh, I don't think we should have won that one, but we did. Uh, the dog ability, I, I suppose it does work. Once you upgrade woof 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 and then you duplicate it, then it, it's functional. Because before that happens, you're using far too many dice to actually make it work. It still feels like the curse is better, but it did work. We, we lived, we won. So, I can't complain too much. I will always complain about the witch though, because the witch sucks. So, for those of you on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. Like the video if you enjoyed it, subscribe for more. Check me out on Twitch for when to go live, support me on Twitch, Patreon, and Streamlabs. And I hope to see you here again for the next episode of Dicey Dungeons.